Wednesday, Wednesday is our beautiful day. 
Wednesday is our beautiful day. Shout out to everyone that have joined us on the Star Radio UK network. And I say good evening and welcome once again. Good evening and good evening and good evening. It says the Star Radio UK. As we get ready for the program, I welcome each and every one of you, especially my producer and all the team that are working behind the scenes. It's a beautiful weather outside as well. Hope you're all enjoying the weather wherever you are. President Tinubu, how hopeful and endurance on the Star Radio UK network is the discussion. There we tell us every single one of you. Yeah, then we we'll get to go. Thank you so much, everyone that have joined us on the Star Radio UK. Yeah. I think that will be fine. Yeah, yeah. Then we got everything sorted out. Yes. Shout out to those of you that have joined us on the Star Radio UK Network. It is your boy, uh, Koi Kiwi, and the Star Radio UK Network. Shout out to all our viewers and listeners from around the world. If it's your first time joining us, uh, sit back and let's drive you home this Wednesday. Uh, shout out to the sister broadcast that is also transmitting the conversation tonight. It is about Bola Ahmed Tinubu, the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. How hopeful and enduring they have been listening, have been following. You know, it's almost three weeks that Bola Tinubu, you know, has been the president. They call him the Jagaban. <laughs> when they say the Jagaban, you know, subsidy remover. There's a lot happening. There's a lot to discuss tonight. I want each and every one of you to sit back tight. And let us enjoy the program. Waris Jinadu, shout out to you and the rest of the hopeful uh, Yoruba nation followers. Uh, you know, you know, I have already told you there's nothing called Nigeria. I had a very good, interesting time. You know, this afternoon, for those of you that were listening to us on the sister broadcast, when I was speaking to a young Turkish boy, uh, 18 years old, I will see if I can get some of what he was telling me. Some mind blowing. Uh, but one thing I can remember saying is that he actually told me fighting a religion is an endless battle. So if you're from Nigeria, you are fighting that religion, please, it is an endless battle. Shout out to my producer. Shout out to, uh, you know, the, the Star Radio UK team around the world. Shout out to Frank. I hope you're enjoying Ghana. Make sure you bring, <laughs> make sure you bring uh, Ghana dollar fries. Shout out to Linda Perry. Shout out to every single one, especially Archie. Actually, has been walking around the clock. If it's your first time joining us, we call this platform. We're going to need a lot of water today, you know. It is in your car. You can listen to us anywhere on your car, in your car, anywhere. But the most important thing is follow us on the Twitter, on the Star Radio DK Network. And I say, Moki Bobole or Onla, I say good evening to you. And once again, this is called. This is Star Radio. This is Star Radio. It is called the Star Radio UK. And if you're joining me for the first time, I say. Welcome in Yoruba means a cabo. A cabo. So yeah, it's just 12 minutes past. It is beautiful outside. The weather is like wow. You know, but we have to be here to do what we have to do. Uh the most important thing is that tonight I'll be looking at reviewing everything when it comes to almost three weeks that Bola Tinubu has been the president. The Yoruba nation followers, shout out to Babakitoye. The oracle is the oracle of the Yoruba nation. You know, this is a man that loves his people so much. He is the real oracle. And we cannot say thank you more than enough time, you know, for standing shoulder to shoulder, especially with, uh, you know, standing there in Benin Republic, you know, with Dr. Chief Sunday Bowo, you know, in the last two years, since uh, the former president, Muhammad Buhari, wanted to kill 
and assassinate Igbowo, but that didn't happen. So thank you so much, Baba Kitoye. You know, the oracle of our time for staying so close to Chief Dr. Sunday Igbowo. We are so grateful. We are very happy. We are excited. And we pray that God grants you more good health. <laughs> Let's get the water going, Paul. Hmm. You need a lot of water uh, in the weather like this. It's quite beautiful outside. I've been enjoying the weather. I hope you're enjoying the weather as well. Tokyo 78, thank you so much. And to the Mixed Air Loud team, thank you. Grammarly Ajayi, thank you so much. Smile Sheung, thank you so much. As you're all joining, I say thank you, thank you. Uh, but one thing you can do for us is... Uh, some of you don't know that we are on Star Radio, you can Twitter. So I'm going to share the link of the Twitter. All you can do for me is just click on the Star Radio UK network. That's all. And then follow. Because if you don't follow me on the Star Radio UK network on Twitter, how do you know I am live? Eh? I want you to follow me. But let's start with the first music tonight. Uh, where should we start from? Should we play, uh, is Nigeria still under pressure? Is Nigeria still under pressure, under Bola Tinubu, or is still early to call the shot? <laughs> oh, my beautiful days, you know, I love the weather. So let's start with, uh, you know, the, the, the under pressure. Grandma Lea Jai, Kileru, She, Bola Tinubu, are under pressure. Abibo Gwen, Onto. If you want to follow us on the Star Radio UK, I'm going to share the link, but let's start with. Raskimono, Raskimono uh, may so uh, may so be in, uh, may so be placed uh, may so be in peace. You know Raskimono died. How many people know that? Raskimono is a Nigerian artist, one of the beautiful artists. Raskimono was a Nigerian reggae artist whose debut whose debut album Under Pressure by a single runner buster. Runner buster was the biggest hit in Nigeria in 1989 before he released his solo album. He was in a group called the Justy Along. This is Raskimono. Is Bola Tinubu under pressure? <laughs> Senior Evangelist John, welcome to the program. It's called Raskimono under the pressure. On the Star Radio UK Network. Oh my lord. Shout out to Archie. Frank, make sure you bring something back for your boy, you know. Raskimono died on the 10th of June 2018 in Lagos, Ekoi. May so rest in peace. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. Raskimono is Bola Tinubu under pressure. Oh, yeah. oh no! Yeah. Shout out to those of you in Kaduna State. Erufai, the short man devil. Oh my lord. Erufai is under pressure. Erufai said no Christian will be governor in Kaduna State. What a country is Nigeria. <laughs> oh yes. Under pressure, under pressure. Who is under pressure today? Mm. Mrs. Olasumbo, good evening. Mary, you know, when, when Raskimono came with this song in 1989, Nigeria was still working. But then, there was another album that was hitting the airwaves. I'm coming with that album, but for now, Enjoy Nigeria is under pressure. Ah, uh, MFL, Buari cannot save you anymore. Ame. It seems that Bola Tinubu is taking everything under pressure because there is now a senior president, Godwill Akwabio. Wow. <laughs> Raskimono, 1989, under the pressure. Oh, now. Are we under pressure, the black people around the world, especially the Yoruba people? It seems that we are really under pressure. 29,000 Yoruba people were killed 
under the former president, Muhammad Buhari. Only Lord knows how many Biafrans or the Igbos were killed. Buhari hated the Igbos so much that Twitter actually removed one of his tweets. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. When Raskimono was singing that song in 1989, he said, no food, no money in the pocket. Do we have money in the pocket now? How many Nigerians have money in the pocket? Raise your hand. If you have, oh, Bola Tinobu is raising his hand there. Bola Tinobu is raising his hand. He said, I got money in my pocket. Even the wife said, we don't need Nigerian money. We just want to make Nigeria to work. Let me bring it down a little bit. Bola Tinobu is raising his hand. Bola Tinobu is raising his hand. Can you see his hand there? He's raising his hand. He said, Yummy, me, I got the money. I got the money. Can you see him there? He says, Raise your hand if you got the money. How much is the Naira today? It seems that the central bank has got now an acting governor. How many more is going before the next few more days? Under pressure. Pop, 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 Bro, bro. Oh, hey, hey. Hold on there. He said, some are die, some are cry, some are singing, some are excited. Bro, Latin is there now. Under pressure, under pressure. Oh, yeah, come on, come on, come on. Bro, bro, bro. This is Star Radio UK Network. Bro, under pressure, under pressure, under, under pressure. Bro, bro. Oh my lord, he mentioned European. It looks like Ukraine might finally be a member of the NATO. And Russia is continuing to put the pressure there. Wow! <laughs> oh! Oh! On the Star Radio UK Network. Oh! Who remember this guy? Who remember the former minister? Hey! Eddie Saraki, <laughs> Nigerian. <Hey. laughs> when is he going to fly? <laughs> Nigeria is really under pressure. Oh. Good evening to you and shout out me, my big uncle there. Today, Narego, yes, so Babami Aro, all the way in America. Welcome to the network. It is the Star Radio UK network. It is under pressure. <laughs> bum, bum. Pra, pra. Just wait for the next track. Wait for the next track. It is 21 minutes fast, and tonight is all about Bola Ahmed Tinobu. And Nigerians now so happy that Buhari is gone. Say bye bye, say Buhari. <laughs> At the next, uh, about almost 7 30, it's going to be a full conversation on the Yoruba Nation sponsored by Ilano Omo Odua. But for now, it's all about Bola Ahmed Tinobu. And Nigerians really thinking I'm hopeful that he's going to turn things around and he's going to make Nigeria a great place. I don't know. What is your take on that? Keep the comment coming. Tinobu presidency, hopeful for Nigeria, is the conversation tonight. Ooh. Ooh. It's all about Bola Tinobu. Do you think that Bola Tinobu should probe every one of the ministers that worked with Buhari? Or do you think he's just going to pass it? Ganiolo Yode said, the last man standing. Ganiolo Yode went on to say, even at the bank said, there is no money. What? No money in the bank? No money in the bank. <laughs> even what is he say, there is no money in the pocket with 500k, 500k loan bill. Wow. So when is Bola Tinubu going to be paying the, boat, the loan? When is the first loan? Where's Bishop Adeshino? Erufai. Eli Rufai, how are you? Eli Rufai, good evening from Star Radio UK Network. We're going to talk about you tonight again. I hope it's okay with you, Eli Rufai. <laughs> the man that said there will not be a Christian governor in a country that is meant to be unity. Unity between the Christian, the Muslim, and the traditionalist. But in Kaduna, you will never be a governor if you're a Christian. Wow! <laughs> My beautiful mother, Titi Crowder, say, 
Tell our people we don't have to sit on the bench. The Yoruba nation has to continue. Yes, so Sunday Adeba and just say, Yoruba nation. <laughs> Tinubu, when are you going to listen to Nandekano? There's a lot to discuss tonight. Nigeria is under pressure. <laughs> oh, I need to drink a bit of more water. Who love my dance? Smile, she will say, Bola Tinubu can never probe a bill. Oh, 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 please don't give me at the third, please. Bola Tinubu, we want you to probe Ganjije. Are you going to probe him? Come on, tell me that. Mr. President, are you going to probe Ganjude, the former governor? You know the Gandola? <laughs> it looks like the new governor continue to destroy Kano because of Ganjude. Nigeria is really under pressure. Ew! <laughs> Who's going to check out? Who is checking out? Under pressure. <laughs> it seems what it is better than water, Baba. The green smoothie is better than water. Okay, I'm gonna tell Mr. Dapo to put under pressure. It looks like today is a beautiful day. Tinobu has a lot in his plate, but it looks like he's chopping it one at a time. You know when you go to when you go to Buka, how many people they go Buka? You go to Amalashita, buffet, <laughs> Hey, don't eat momo again, no. Nigerian federal government said nobody should eat momo again. <laughs> Daddy Niaro, this one is for you. Because uh, 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 why did you check out of Nigeria? Eh? How many of you check out of Nigeria? When we should stay in Nigeria, fix Nigeria. Come on, man. Come on, man. Go and survive, man. Nigeria go survive. Ooh. <laughs> Who remember this? In the 80s. Who remember this? Andrew. Andrew. Senior evangelist. Who? Who remember this? On the Star Radio UK Network this evening. Before we go live into the program. It is coming up to 25 minutes past 6 p.m. The Star Radio UK Niger Voices every Wednesday. Who remember this? Who remember this? Who? You, you, know, you know when those, our uncle, were running out of Nigeria? They never told us they are not coming back. You only say you are going to America to study. You were going to South Korea. You have spent 30 years. You are not going back to Nigeria. What is going on? Ooh. Andrew, Andrew, don't check out. Tipe, tipe. But uh, what is he say? It looks like Daddy Waro, you have to come back to Nigeria because Nigeria will survive. <laughs> hey. So, ooh. It is Star Radio UK. 8, 8, 19. Hey, let's listen. Even if they clear the gas, so Nigeria no go survival. They have been drinking the oil since 1960. Babangida drank the oil. Abacha drank the oil. Buari say Baba, the president of Nigeria before. You drank so much oil, you kept Nigeria in the low power. <laughs> oh, good evening and welcome. Hey, how many of you check out? Me, I don't check out over 25 years ago, and I don't think I'm going back soon because Nigeria is not surviving. But are Nigerians hopeful? That is the conversation tonight. Good evening to my family. Good evening to my beautiful mother. Good evening to my wife. Good evening to my children. Good evening to all Omo Yoruba. <laughs> oh! Daddy Miaro went on to say that that is why I am joining the forces with like minded people like you to climb up for Ilua Jerry. Hey, Karo Jire. <laughs> How many people can raise their hand and say Nigeria go survive? Are they going to release him the Kanu? He's not doing very well. He has a good health problem. He needs to travel like fire shape. He needs to travel like boy. <laughs> I remember say Baba. Say Baba love traveling. Every little opportunity Buari travel out of Nigeria. But the problem is, who we'll still believe that Nigeria go survive? Let's listen more before we go into the full program tonight. <laughs> Oh my God! 
We must unite, according to Bola Tinobu. Nobody will break Nigeria. We must survive together. <laughs> You're gonna survive with under 130 million Nigerians in abject poverty. What is the world saying? 21 innocent people died yesterday. We lost three as well in Nottingham. May the soul of those that died in Nottingham and those that are receiving treatment on behalf of the Star Radio UK Network, we pray for the family. But let's talk about Nigeria. Let's talk about Ghana. Let's talk about the death going on in Africa, most populous black nation called Nigeria tonight. <laughs> oh, are you sure that Nigeria is going to survive? This woman wasting this song. They know, are you sure Nigeria will survive? Because as many Nigerians are saying, <laughs> <laughs> Mommy Nititini, Andrew, where are you going? I am checking out. <laughs> How many people think Nigeria is going to survive? Under President Bola Tinobu. Who remembers Say Baba? Look at his face. The former president that destroyed Nigeria so much that we now have more insecurity that Bola Tinobu will have to deal with. <laughs> I say shout out to you, Prince Adekun Lego Kibo going to Lagos Island. Mokibo going to Bata Etu Kabo. So the Eto Star Radio UK Niger Voices New London. Oh, 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 Waris, you are a bad guy, you know. Waris is just reminding me that Governor Kenneth Olu is in Germany receiving treatment, so he doesn't believe in Nigeria to survive. <laughs> Waris, you are a bad man. How come you are bringing Akele Dolu into this conversation? Leave the man alone. He's a governor and he has only traveled out of the country to get a medical treatment. There's nothing wrong in that. Even the former president and the new president are all receiving treatment outside Nigeria because they don't trust the Nigerian medical system. <laughs> Ooh. Mr. Sunday Adeban just say Nigeria is finished since 1960. Hey -oh. Shout out to you, Walata. I hope you're working out in this beautiful weather. Oh, I pity people that walk outside though. Eh? The weather, the weather in UK, the weather in UK is about 27, but it's much lesser than somebody in Kanu. Shout out to those of you in Kanu. Shout out to people in Nigeria. Hey -oh. We're talking about the president tonight. It's all about Bola Ahmed Tinobu. Moki, you have busted, hey, Rachel. You say you're a bad nation, not going back. Even Evan knows that. Wow. <laughs> I love that too much. <laughs> Who is going to travel with the last flight to Yoruba Nation? I am number three. Igbowo is number two. Babakito is number one. You can pick another number, but don't pick one to three. <laughs> My mother, Titi, went on to say, survival care. Nigeria has collapsed. People are just in denial. <laughs> it is called the Star Radio UK Network, and I welcome you. In just about two more minutes, we go into the conversation. Andrew, don't check out. Say what? Everybody must stay and build Nigeria. That is what Bola Tinobu is saying. He's got a Senate president, Apabio, and they are promising Nigerians the best in this government. What is your take about everything so far with Bola Tinobu, the subsidy, the uh, you know the student loan? Some Nigerians are saying which loan? Eh? HF team say Senate member claim his chief judge wife favors some of his friends. I'm going to talk about that. Thank you so much for reminding me. Shout out to those of you on the Mix LR. I know you are there. Comrade Plan B say it is a cool weather today. Uh, do you know that somebody died in Ibadan and the body has been there for four days <laughs> in Nigeria? Oh my lord. Let's go back and listen to more uh, if Nigeria will survive or not. <laughs> How many people think Nigeria is going to survive under President Bola Tinobu? He says we shouldn't break Nigeria. Let's try to work with Nigeria. <laughs> Chief Bola Ahmed Adekunle Tinobu, GCFR was born according to <laughs> according to <laughs> according to 29th of March 1952. He's a Nigerian politician. They call him Jagaban. Jagaban. Who is the 16th and the current president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria? He was the former governor of Lagos State from 1999 to 2007. Is he going to probe Obasanjo? <laughs> hey. Oh my God. 
My mommy Titi went on to say it is in raining in Toronto, so the weather is just oh no no. You the guys need if you are in Toronto, I think the weather in Canada you need a lot of rain, and I pray for those of you there because the weather has been affecting so much uh, wildfire. You also went on to say Tinubu can never probe Gandude because Baba Riga Bullion Bank campaign for him. Oh, <laughs> you're making me cry now. Don't say that, Tinubu. Are you going to prove? To us that you are Omar Pop and you know the Omar Ali pro than today the former governor Babariga because the new governor just destroyed a roundabout he's been destroying everything destroyable are you listening to the new governor of Cardona State he went on to say that we can have Islam and become and, and make it to become innovative I don't get that I'm going to give you more about that later on tonight. Blood is thicker than water. Nigerians must survive, according to not me, Benno, because for me, Nigeria no go survive. <laughs> <laughs> if Andrew do in work, oh, Nigeria go survive. Tinubu is just trying. He himself knows he's just reassuring, assuring, assuring. I am assuring. What he say? But how many retired or current Nigerian presidents, Senate rep? Many are without diplomatic passport. They have diplomatic passport. Come on, man, worries. These are important people in our society. Eh? Ew. <laughs> Star Radio UK Network. Akpabio visit uh, Tinubu in the Aso Villa. Aso Rock Aso Villa. Do you think that Akpabio and Tinubu are going to make the best out of the 10th Senate? What do you think? Keep the comment coming. I'll be discussing everything tonight. Tinubu, Akpabio, where is going to be? What is going to happen? Let's discuss everything tonight on the Star Radio UK Network. Dajabia <laughs> Mila. Andrew, please do not run away from Nigeria because Nigeria will survive according to not me. <laughs> Nigeria will survive. Hey, oh. Do you think that Nigeria will survive another 63 years? Now let's come to the conversation. My name is Olami Koiki and you're welcome to the Star Radio UK Network as we are now going into the conversation. We've done too much of the music. If you're joining me for the very, 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 very first time, this is how I welcome you. And this is again. This is Star Radio. This is Star Radio. Well, shout out to my producer, Mr. Frank David, Mr. Archie, and the rest of the Star Radio UK team. Tomorrow is the property hour. Make sure you join us. But tonight is all about the Niger voices as we continue to ask Nigerians, what is your take? Oh, uh, I didn't get Akpabio very well in this picture, eh? Akpabio, sorry. Mm, the engineer did not put your picture very well. They actually put your picture right behind my head. Let me move like Can you say Akpabio? How many people can say Akpabio? Eh? Mm -hmm. Bola Tinobu, Senate President, Nigeria, almost three weeks, May 29, everything has gone quiet. Nigerians are becoming hopeful every day. They, they're looking at the news. Let me first go on the social media and let's find out what is happening on the social media when it comes to Nigeria. Nigerians have been battling it out on the social media network. Remember, again, let me remind you, the only way you can follow the Star Radio UK Network is to click on that link that is coming on your screen in just about a few minutes and do the subscription. It's free. Nobody's charging you for that. You don't have to pay for that. It is absolutely free. And just click on that and then follow us. And that way you will see the notification when I'm live with the Star Radio UK Network or when they go live. So the link is coming up to you right now. And all you have to do, just click on that link. For those of you on the Facebook, we we'll see if we can bring the link because Facebook have been really dealing with us for a couple of days now. But I will say, I think we are back on putting the comment there. Yeah, I think so, yeah. So let me bring that on as well. So let me ask those on the social media before coming to those of you in the comment section. What is our take? At exactly 7.30, the program goes into a full Yoruba conversation. It's a sponsored program where we speak in Yoruba. 
you will also be able to call in. But for now, let's speak in English so that we can communicate with all our listeners and followers from around the world. I welcome you. London Tech Week is going on as we speak. It's a very busy week. Innovation, technology. Do you think that Bola Tinobu can use technology to change the narrative? Do you think that Bola Tinobu can make Nigeria great again? So many Nigerians are hopeful that Bola Tinobu is going to turn things around. Is that your own take as well? Do you believe that? Do you think that he has what it takes to make the turnaround that Nigerians are looking for? Omotayo says, quite sure because our Yoruba president has started doing good job between almost three weeks. Thank you so much, Salako. We respect your views and we appreciate your time with us. Like I always say, we have nothing against the president, Bola Tinobu, but we are the Yoruba nation followers under the leadership of Professor Adebanja Kitoyi. Good evening to you, Mr. Adekoya. Good evening to you once again, Omotayo Salako. Sorry, I'm just saying some of your comments. You know, I'm really, really sorry. I didn't realize that those comments have been coming through. Apology because I did not overlook it. You also went on to say Tinubu is the best answers caused all this provocation to Nigerians youth. But student bill has been said by Jakarta. Yusuf Olua Femi Martins also said, good evening, Mr. Koiki. Thank you so much to those of you that have joined. Um, my mother, Mrs. Titi, a grandmother, I believe as well, went on to say, survive another 60 years, what? She went on to say, Tinobu is just trying, he himself knows, is just reassuring Nigerians. My job here is to look into everything and bring it to you. In three weeks, Tinobu has been in power. Emefele arrested. Are you happy? Emefele caused the death of so many Nigerians. Whether you are Yoruba, whether you are Igbo, whether you are Aousa, it may fail it cause the death by changing what we believe was not necessary as at the time it may fail it was changing the Nera North. Do you think that Tinobu is going to probe it may fail it, and it may fail it is going to say, I was only taking instruction from the former president, Muhammad Buhari. So what do you think is going to happen? They probably release it may fail it, it may fail it continue his life, and that will be the end of it. How do we fight the corruption? I've been following some of the gigantic, big, big numbers. And we will land, 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 big, big numbers. This previous government under the former president, Muhammad Buhari, is the most corrupt that we've ever witnessed. And I'm going to prove that to you again tonight. If you are not too sure, sit back and listen and enjoy the program tonight. But first and foremost, let me post the link of the Star Radio UK for those of you that are watching us so that you can also make sure you put in, uh, you click on that link, follow the link, and that way you can make sure you are part of us tonight. Nigerians are very, very hopeful people. The way Buhari came in 2015, Nigerians were very, very hopeful. They had everything to think that Buhari was going to turn Nigeria into one pound to one dollar. Again, Nigerians are still hopeful. And we can't blame any Nigerians because they believe in Nigeria. Mrs. Florence said, this is just to make people believe. We give him another three weeks. Okay? Buhari did not do to say, just a slap on the Nefili. Kalas, story over. Thank you so much to every one of you that have joined the network. So we are just here to review. It's still early to cut the short. We cannot decide everything now that Bola Tinubu is doing, but we are only looking into it and discussing it. Once again, we have nothing. And I keep saying that we have nothing, especially as a Yoruba man. We have nothing against it. But one thing is, it's our duty and it's our job to keep them on the toes. So as we all prepare for this new government, 21 Nigerians died again yesterday by the blood-tasting Fulani terrorists that continue to create havoc 
and that continue to kill as many of our loved ones. Elijah Okoyemi say, Tinubu will change the country to be better. Thank you so much for your comment. Keep those comments coming. And like I say, we are not biased here. Even if those comments is not comfortable with us, we have to read it out. The weather is very, very warm outside. It's about 27, so we need a lot of water. Shout out to my big brother, Olari Wajo in Paris. Goodness underscore add 10. Thank you so much to each and every one of you that have joined me tonight. Tinobu has a lot of work in his hand. But how he's going to manage each of these is what I don't know. But let's listen to what the former president, Muhammad Buhari, said. Do you think, I don't know, what do you think? Do you think Buhari can be pro or people under Buhari just like a meeting? Let's listen to the former president, Muhammad Buhari. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever it is will be in trouble. Did you hear that? Should I play that again? How many people heard what the former president, Muhammad Buhari, said? This is the Star Radio UK Network. Let's listen to it again. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever it is will be in trouble. Nobody. I hope everyone can hear me loud and clear. May go. If not, I can switch the sound to the Star Radio UK. But if you can hear me on the sister broadcast, Clearly, just let me know. Thank you so much. Uh, you know, and I'm talking to those of you in Canada because I can make sure that we can go straight into the uh, the studio so sound rather than my own mic. Is my mic coming out very well for those of you watching us on the okay? Smile, show say very good. Yes, uh, those of you on the mix LR, is the sound coming out? Just let me know before I go full into the conversation because I might not be looking at the screen back to back. So everybody agree that the sound is very good. Okay, Zay, read it out to us, please. Thank you so much. So, Buhari went to say that nobody should come and call him for any evidence. If not, you will all be in trouble. Well, listen to me for the last time. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever it is, will be in trouble. Nobody should... Come and ask me to give any evidence in the court of law. And if you do so, whoever, if it's Bola Tinobu, if it's any one of you, you will be in trouble. What does it mean by you will be in trouble? Thank you so much, Omotayo Salako. Thank you so much, Ebenezer. When I was saying, the president, the blood sucker. We can't hear the insane Buari. That was exactly what he said. Buhari said nobody should come and tell him to come and do anything. Three weeks. How much more time? Because everything has to be thrown to Bola Tinobu. We've sent him a letter, Baba Kintoye. The Biafra are now asking about Inam Bekanu. What do you think? What is your take? My name is Ola Mekoiki. This is the Star Radio UK Network. Let me go back and let you listen to another person. But before that, I wanted to give you what is happening on the social media network. The central bank is trending. The Naira is trending. Why is the Naira trending? And I'm going to be telling you why. The Naira eat 755 Naira to a dollar. Hmm. Hey, yeah? Hmm. Those of you from the Southeast, how do you say hmm in your language? Hey, hey? BD said Tinobu and the co travelers are there to get their own share of the cookies. <laughs> Which kind of cookies? Is it chocolate cookies? I love I love the um, the milky cookies. When you put on the milk cookies in your mouth, it dissolves like that, especially when you're buying it from the right place. Once again, my name is Alami Koiki, and I will continue to look at the three weeks. It is too early to cut the short. 
but we are still monitoring everything under this new government, Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Nera is really, really trending. Many Nigerians do not have access to dollar. Only one particular tribe called the Ausa have access to the dollar, while the rest of us goes to the black market. Hmm. Hey, hey. And that is behind there, the dollar and the Nera. Okeze went on to say, we knew it was from Nijay. That was why he constructed the road and the rail lines to Nijay. He also built refinery and buying SUV to the people of Nijay through the crazy Rotimi Amechi. What is in order to say, Petro and Nera Wahala. It's only three weeks. Just like our mother say, we cannot put every blame on Tinubu now. But we have to continue to keep an eye on the toe or keep an eye on the ball. Why is the Nera trending? Because in any economy today, thank you so much, Mr. Ajayi Anthony. I mean, Equeto, Yoruba nation will surely come to stay. Thank you so much to my beautiful wife and my lovely children and my also beautiful mother and all the family back home as well. Let's talk about the Nera. How many people understand how the Nera works? You need a strong economy for your money to be very good. I am not an economics. I am just a journalist. But let me tell you what I can, I can read from those experts. The market rate is said to be willing buyer, willing seller arrangement. What is you know, What does that mean? Can you break it down for me? Winning buyer, winning seller arrangement. The Nera is currently trading at 750 to 755 per dollar at the investor and exporter window. So that literally means that, does it mean that breathing Larry Lamina? Does it mean that um, you can buy at any price? Is this something good? Is that a good price? Because it seems that a lot of Nigerians are trending the Nera this evening. Sunday at the band just said, Nigeria cannot work again, again. It never worked before since 1960, okay? Zoo, Nigeria is finished. Ajay Anthony said, the Lord is your strength. Keep it up. Thank you so much. Let's go further. According to sources, I told the cable on Wednesday that the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, has directed commercial banks to sell forex, which equivalent mean dollar, freely at market determined rate. Bishop Adeshina is not with us tonight. Who is going to help me out? Good evening to you, Grandma Beauty underscore Amope. Oh, my brother is there, Shegun Ono. Ben Ikoiki, strong economy means strong currency. I gotta write that down. Strong. Oh my lord, can I get a good pen in this house, in the studio? I need a very, very good pen because we have to get things written down. Thank you so much, my brother there, for giving us a bit of what it means. I think I should have one here. Okay, let's write it down. A good economy or a strong economy means a strong currency. Strong economy means strong currency. Thank you so much, my big brother there, comrade. Good evening to you once again. Okesi, you went on to also went on to say, that is a Nigerian born question. Aziz in Miami, my brother. Good evening and welcome. Okay, it's, tonight is all about you because we're looking at Bola Tinobu three weeks while I continue to look around some of the conversation going on as well. Okay, they went on to say they are all hiding under Tinobu to commit havoc. The full are on it again. I had a dream. Nigeria was divided into three. Well separated. Please mark this day. And I believe in your dream because whether I like it or not, like my mother said there, Mrs. Flore uh, Mrs. Titi in Canada, she went on to say the grandmom that Nigeria can never survive again. 
Okay, so we want to say, Odudu and Biafra and Arewa will be the final result of the Nigeria Miss Fortune. Keep the comment coming and be rest assured I'll be reading them out. Daniel Loyode and the rest of you, thank you so much. So let's go back again into the Naira. This implies that Nigeria has eased its control of the Naira, allowing the local currency to free float. A free floating exchange rate of calls. So this is what it means in the lema. Idris Abimbola, our bro is I believe is a mother. Thank you so much for joining us, our beautiful mother. You say good evening, brother. Yoruba nation of going back. So in T or Ito Daleju at 7 30, like I said, it's gonna be full Yoruba, but for now, because it is still a conversation on the international discussion comrade shagwan will say a weak naira is a reflection of nigeria weak economy i love that again a weak naira so what can bola ahmed Tinubu do to project a strong naira a weak naira is a reflection reflection of nigeria weak economy so what can tinobu do or the central bank to bring a strong economy or a strong naira it is the june 14 2023 on the star radio uk network keep the comment coming so a free floating exchange rate of calls when a government allows the exchange rate to be determined purely by the market forces and there is no attempt to ask the central bank to influence the external value of the exchange rate. So if I'm in Nigeria and I want to go to US or I want to buy something that got to do with dollar, that means that I would have to buy, is that the bank rate? But that is not the black market rate. Am I right, uh, Mr. Comrade Shegu Ono? This 750 to 755, is that the bank rate, the float banking rate? But this is not the black market rate because i am not sure whether this is the black market can somebody explain because we are not an economics adios shon timothy the farmer next week's wednesday in coin B. Next week, Wednesday. Black market rate is 700 plus. So this one is the window between the exporter and investor. But if me, Olayomi Koiki, wants to travel out of Nigeria, even though Andrew say, don't check out to, does that mean that I will have to buy at 755 naira per dollar and if i cannot get my hands because all this bank doesn't have any dollar each time you go there even if you are a legitimate traveler you are told to go to the black market controlled by the northerners across the country no yoruba man no Igbo man no kanuri man no other ethnic group is dealing with the dollar exchange can Bola Tinubu stop that? Can Bola Tinubu change the narrative? Where are these northerners getting the dollar to change to Nigerians rather than going into the bank? What is in order to say a strong Naira means demonetizing the Naira, monetizing the Yoruba land resources for extreme value in return for the Yoruba land and water resources. Comrade Shegun went on to say, but Tinubu is about to harmonize the bank and the black market rate for dollar. Oh, so does that mean that if what Tinobu is planning to do now is to make sure that the dollar rate at the black market is the same thing with the bank, that would be very good. Because Nigerians shouldn't be buying the black market rate when the bank should be providing the dollar in the first place. And everybody needs dollar for different reasons. I mean, I have family that buy things outside Nigeria and they will not be using Naira, they will need a dollar. Hmm. 
Interesting time. I can now see why they call him the Jacobin. <laughs> He's about to deal with the northerners. Do you think that Palatinobu is going to step on the toes of some people? Hmm. Omotai Osalako went on to say, I know that Baba Jagaban will bring Sunday Adeyama back to Nigeria. Jagaban knows that AKA Igbo is a fighter of Yoruba land. Our president is one of the street boys who knows the big cards and will react as his own time. God bless Nigeria. Thank you so much, Mr. Salako. Keep your comment coming and be rest assured. We are not biased here. We will read them out as it comes through. So Nigerians, my question tonight is, three weeks to Bola Tinobu, the president of the Nigeria, the number 16. Three weeks. My grandmother, Titi, went on to say, it's better we divide now and stop postponing the evil days. 21 innocent Nigerians died again yesterday in Plateau State, 107 people died in Quara, not because of terrorists, because they had a boat capsized. Hmm. Over 270 of them were inside a particular boat that, oh, mm, mm, mm. Hey. and there's no, huh. there's no uh, safety vest. So as the boat capsized, everybody will just be drinking water, mm, 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 mm. and there's no emergency. 107 people died in Kwara State yesterday. Wow. Nigeria is problematic. Hmm. The days are ahead. Let's come back again to the current situation. Let's leave the dollar. Let's come back to Apabio, Volatinobu, the, uh, the, uh, the, um, the House of Red, how do you think they're going to manage this current state of economy of Nigeria? Bola Tinobu needs a lot of money to run the economy. It will need a lot of money. So he's trying to force cut wherever there's a loophole. Do you think that Akpabio would be a better Senate president? What is your take on that? We're telling them to adjust the screen a little bit. Maybe they, they should give us a better Akpabio because some of our people don't know who is Akpabio. So the engineer is getting another image of Akpabio and Bola Tinobu alone so that we can discuss. Ahmed Lawan was a former Senate president under President Mamadou Buhari. He was a rubber stamp. He was just doing yes sir, yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. Everything Buhari said, yes sir. Do you think that Akpabio will be a little bit much different? Most of these politicians have been in the game. I'm going to talk about the senator that said, my wife is doing a better deal for me by changing results during the court of appeal. He was the same man I interviewed in London. Okay, now we are now, let's see, uh, engineer, can you please adjust uh, the screen a little bit for us? We cannot see the president, Bola Tinobu, we can see Akwabio, uh, but we can't see Tinobu. So the engineer is adjusting. Okay, no, 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 let's get, yeah, I should be in the center, engineer, better. Thank you so much, our engineer. And that is a city president. As they say, Awasabotua and those Kaba, those are the people controlling the black market. Okay, I didn't know that. At 7.30, it's going to be all full show with the Yoruba nation and the self-determination, the indigenous people. What is Bola Tinubu going to do with Sunday Bowo and Inam Dekano, the two important freedom fighters of our time? So stay tuned, don't go anywhere at exactly 7.30 in the next 29 minutes. But for now, the discussion is focused on the Senate president. Now that that has been resolved, Bola Tinobu now has a full government without his ministerial position. We are waiting for who is going to be who under any of the ministry. But now that we have Akwabio as the Senate president, what is your take on that? Those of you that are listening to us tonight. What do you think 
can be of any change. Do you think that there will be something different between this new Senate president as against the former Senate president Ahmed Lawa? Listen again. This is. Okay, this is Star Radio UK. In your car, at home, broadcasting worldwide online 24/7. Broadcasting worldwide online 24/7. In your car, at home, the best radio show. The best radio show. The best radio show every Wednesday. Join me when we discuss the issue. And you can also listen to it from any of your platform, your phone, your device. Do you know that Gandude is actually trending? Hmm. But before we go to Gandude, Let's talk about the Senate president. What is the role of a Senate president? Who can give me, thank you so much, Black Mercy 001, Sunday Bo is coming. My president, Ashiwaji, will bring him back. Can't wait for Osha to come back home. Thank you so much, Black Mercy 001 on Instagram. Went to say, Sunday Bo is coming. I've, I've listened to um, K1, the ultimate. I'm going to be playing the music later on, saying that Bola Tinobu should just, you know what? allow Sunday Bo to come back, but that will be in the next 26 minutes, so you have to stay tuned. But for now, the discussion is the Senate president, Bola Tinobu government, do you think that there will be any changes? Aziz went on to say, no Yoruba man in the black market, only the Bururu. <laughs> I love that, only the Bururu. So now that the Nera is trending, Gandude is also trending, but there is something going on in Kano that I seem to get a little bit confusion. Fellas, say confusion, get the bony, yeah, but double wala for the body and the owner for the body, double wala, like the way I beat you, I beat you yesterday, double wala for the body. Why is the new governor? Doing a lot of destruction in Kano. I don't get it. Why is the new governor of Kano State making so much destruction of what the former governor spent millions, if not, I mean, I don't know, millions of naira. I can't say billions. Why is Nigeria always backwards? Why is, you know, to say another Bola Ahmed Tinobu payback? Political stone, a Fabio. So you think that is a political stone? Hmm. Innovative. Thank you so much. It's already tech week, and there's a lot going on in London. I can assure a lot of you. London is very, very busy. If you are into technology, you would have loved to be in London this week. Over hundred million pounds is going to be invested by Rishi Sunak, our Prime Minister. Why is the Kano State Governor? I don't get it. A lot of you might not know Gandude Babariga. I asked the question earlier. Do you think that Bola Ahmed Tinobu, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, GCFR, will probe the former governor? Or is the current governor going to deal with him without waiting for Bola Tinobu since they're not in the same political party? As is from Miami, I say good afternoon to you, Igbowo Osha. Sunday, Adeyemo in Male Yoruba. My brother, Comrade Chagun, new governor from another party in Kano. I know that. But why is he destroying some of the projects that the former governor? Ganduje Gandola. Ganduje Gandola. Thank you so much, engineer, for giving us all these images because so many people that are not from Nigeria do not know these individuals. 
So let me give you a bit of, uh, I'm just going through a lot of what is happening in Nigeria, but the focus point is all about the President Bola Tinubu. Keep your comment coming. On Motaya Salapase, Apabio will do his best because he has a good integrity from where, from when he start his own government job. He also bowed down for Tinubu during, okay, he bowed, okay. Wow, I, did, I almost forgot that. So, Apabio gave Tinobu the bow by not contesting with him. Okay, now I get the message. Thank you, Salako. Interesting days ahead. Where is the governor of Kanu? The other video, Ganduje asked God to restrain EFCC from probing him. <laughs> Just like Buhari, say Baba. Maybe we should listen to say Baba again. Say Baba, say Buhari. This is what Buhari said. That if anybody try, if you make any attempt, this is the former president, Muhammad Buhari. Nobody should ask me to come and give any evidence in any court. Otherwise, whoever I think is in trouble. Say Baba. Say Baba say, if anybody tell him to come to court, you will be in trouble. But what about, okay, let's say that Buhari has, you know, immunity. I don't know whether I still have immunity, I don't know, because I don't know how things work in Nigeria. Nigeria is a lawless country, so, you know, we can just continue to speculate from here, you know, in London. The weather is about 26 degrees, it's very, very cloudy at the moment. There's a lot, there's not much wind. Uh, when I was on the bus, I don't know why the London bus doesn't have air condition compared to some other countries around the world. Eh? Transport for London, please upgrade some of these buses. The weather is too hot. Sunday at the band just say, does people, does people, does people Fulani are part of Nigeria? Or we probably want to say, are Fulani part of Nigeria spending our money anyhow? Hmm. Why is the former governor, Ganduje, now saying that you cannot probe me, EFCC? Do you think that EFCC would just mm, ignore? Since we saw Ganduje did a lot of campaign for Bola Ahmed Tinubu, I understand Bukachukwa favoring politician. My wife is an high court judge. Somebody's already defending him. I'm going to talk about him as well. There's just all these politicians. Sometimes you ask yourself, is it the same way an average Nigerian enjoy peace? Remember the senator that I met in London? I never know he was a senator during the Ike Kirimadu court proceeding. I did an interview with him. I asked him while he was in London, if Ike Kirimadu has built a better hospital, he shouldn't be in London. I didn't know that he was a senator until, he, until I got back home and I Googled him and I realized that, wow, so I was actually speaking to a senator. It's the same senator that says, my wife, eh? The former appeal court president, sometimes, do me some favor. You do me, I do you. God know best. You do me, I do you. Not immunity, but impunity. Koiki. Okay. Impunity. Thank you. Hmm. Interesting days ahead. The same can do J allow the use. Okay, yes. Yeah, so, yes, impunity. I said not Im immunity. Yes, impunity. The, the, I did say, do Buari still have impunity? I don't know whether, I mean, Ganduje doesn't have any impunity anymore. So why is he saying that the EFC cannot arrest him? Eh? Gandola, who be you where they say nah, nobody can arrest you? Are you, are you, are you, are you fooling me, Sabinu? Are you joking? Let's read a little bit from that. Abdullah Ganduje Babariga Gandola, the immediate past governor, the man behind me in that green Agbada, he normally likes to wear Agbada because he stopped dollar anytime contractor come to his office. He like to stop Baba and dollar, you know, because nobody must see the dollar. The immediate past governor of Kano State is asking the High Court in Kano to perpetually restrain the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, EFCC, from inviting him, investigating him over video clips allegedly showing him receiving dollar from a contractor. The clip was in 2018. 
Mr. David Olawale, welcome to the program. Better days are here. What is your take on that? 12 minutes past 7 p.m. We go back again to Bola Tinobo because the conversation is all about him tonight. Three weeks into the power. There's been a lot of visitors there and there. People have been visiting the president. It's normal. He has a lot of work ahead of him. But my point is, how is he going to deal with the insecurity? Do you think that he should keep all the service chief, what is your take? Prince Adekunle, thank you so much. Good evening once again to those of you on the Mixed LR. Welcome. It is a cool Wednesday. The weather is beautiful. Sunday, Adebanjo went on to say, Fulani are not Nigerians, 100%. Buari is from Niger. I ask again, do you think Sheki Bola Tinobu, the president, Sheko Kip Uguba, the service chief, the chief of army staff, the navy, every one of them, keep them again maybe for another one year, two years? We are concerned with the death of innocent Nigerians. One death means a lot. 21 years today is more than too much, including a pastor. Do you think that the president, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, do you think he needs to change all the service chief? My beautiful auntie, Elin, thank you so much. Not just for the love of the Yoruba, but for the love of Kogi State. May Elin Dumari continue to be with you and bless you as you continue to work tirelessly. In 16 minutes, the conversation will focus on the right to self-determination, sponsored by Professor Oraku Alano. And I have another good picture that is now circulating about that woman that came to destroy the woman, I mean, to destroy the movement, the Daguru woman called Dupe Onitiri. There's a new flyer that we have produced for her. I will be showing you that. In the next 16 minutes. Grandma Adeshion Adelani, I welcome you into the live conversation. Grandma Adeola Oshinoye, Osinloye, Osinloye, thank you so much and welcome to all our beautiful mothers and fathers around the world. My name is Olami Koiki. This is the Star Radio UK Network and we are looking at the three weeks. It's still early. It's not three years. It's not one year. It's not six months. It's not three months. But so far, what is your take? On some of the steps that Bola Tinobu is taking. And the, in, by 7.30, the focus will be, is he going to release the Kanu? Is he going to allow Igbo to return back to Nigeria as a free person and continue his right to self-determination? Because we know that Bola Tinobu at some point was also a freedom fighter fighting under the Nadeko. He's now a president and he has already said it. As much as he might not want a right of the Yoruba people, he's not a dictator. He's a civilian government. We are not in the military era. Sunday Adibanjo went on to say, the government, Nigerian government, free our freedom fighter now. Hashtag Igbo, hashtag Inandekano for life. Keep your comment coming. I'll be reading them out and I'll be telling you more in the next 14 minutes. As we continue to review Bola Tinobu, let's talk about the court case. There is still a court case going on. Do you think that the court will change the narrative? I don't know because Atiku is still not satisfied. Peter Obi is not satisfied yet. Election petition. There's so many evidence that continue to be brought to the court. Do you think that there will be a conclusion with the election petition in Nigeria? 
She had a way, change this for come away. It is so bright from the view outside, beautiful, exciting, but also a little bit hot. Let's read a little bit again from some of your comments. Ganyolo Ede said Nigeria can never survive the student loan coming from where? Hmm. Okay. Who else is there? I saw a comment from someone just now. Let's see if I can pick that from Oluwole or something. 419, politician, chartered foreign airline and brought it to Nigeria. But Sariki, Saridi, he said say that he hasn't spent too much. He hasn't spent too much. Keep your comment coming. I'll be reading them out. From a new governor, from another party. Why the destruction is what I don't understand. I'm still asking the question. Two questions I'm asking you now. The security chiefs, check it in who keep one, or remove them and bring in new faces that can deal with the terrorism happening in Nigeria. The court case, killer Rukumaje outcome. Maintained for life 2001 on the Instagram. Thank you so much. And also, Amakulex, you're welcome to the program. Once again, David Olawolese Ekwishe. If you're joining me for the very, 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 very first time, I say it is called. Looking at some of the evidence by Peter B. Atiku, let me read some of what is happening from the social media in terms of the current situation with the election petition. So let's go and read what people are saying. Kennedy Wandara at Kennedy Wandara underscore some eight hours ago. Nigeria Electoral Commission failure to promptly upload copies of the polling unit results sheet to the IREF is part of the ground of Peter Obi's petition challenging the election of President Bola Tinobu at Premium Times Nigeria analysis revealed that Obi, not Tinobu, won in River State. Hmm. Let's read more. The Nation Nigeria the National Publicity Secretary of the Labour Party, Mr. Abayomi Arabambi, has testified before the election petition tribunal sitting in Ikeja, Lagos, that Amu Wadofi of House of Representative Member, Mr. Olawande George, was never a candidate of the party of the February 25th election. Wahala, no, they stop. Oh. Let's go further. Nigerian pattern underscore or at multi multi mothers went on to say everyone should listen to this clear as ABC. I next chairman Mahmoud Yakubu will appear tomorrow before the presidential election court. Naira, okay, let me let me play that audio in just about a few minutes. Also, uh, more reaction. The nation Nigeria, the presidential election petition court today admitted in evidence statistics report of inspector of election. <laughs> Too much grammar. Sunday, Adiban just say, who spoil Nigeria? Is Christian history book, Bible, Islamic history book, Quran? They have been using Bible and Quran since 1960. To swear for the Nigerian politician. Since today, nothing happened to them. Bible and Quran are the European history book of Arabic generation. Culture is the biggest car in Yoruba land, Igbo land, Hausa land, 100%. Thank you so much. Keep the comment coming. Uh, I want to play a reminder video. It's going to come in an audio. What Mamu told us in London in Chathamouth. Let's listen to him a little bit. There's an electronic device called my model voter accreditation system. That is Viva. We suggested it in several of my elections and upcycling of the ship elections. In addition, 
the decision to make polling unit election results available for public viewing, which has always been a major demand by citizens and election observers, exactly falls into this early choice of election technology. The INEC results viewing portal, the IREM, is a dedicated web portal for the public view of polling unit results as soon as they are finalized on election day. So why IS has been uh, employed in several elections conducted by the Commission in the past few years. In particular, the uploading of polling unit results to the IREM portal has been deployed in 105 constituencies where the Commission conducted off-season elections since August. This was uh, when the INEC chairman Mahmoud came to London promising the upload of the result. The election going on in Nigeria, I mean, sorry, the, the election that was concluded, my question to Nigerian is, do you still have hope with the election tribunal? Let's go further. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has cautioned the Labour Party, known as LP, and its presidential candidate, Peter Obi, to desist from blaming it for, the, for their inability to effectively prosecute their cases before the presidential election petition court. Hmm. What do you think will be the outcome is the question that I'm asking tonight. We're going to take one more from the election tribunal. We're going to move swiftly because I now have six minutes before Ilanomo do a sponsor program on the Yoruba Nation is going to come in. DJ underscore 75 say capital no with the Nigeria judicial system. Okay. Good evening to our beautiful mother, grandmother, Wura underscore Adi underscore beauty into two. Tolu Alashe underscore five. And the rest of you that have joined us so far. The last one from the election petition tribunal before we move further, Mr. Peter Obi and his Labour Party LP on Wednesday again tender additional blur INEC result viewing Porter IREF document before the presidential election petition call. So let's leave that and come back again now to another judicial wahala. Oh, hmm. Nigeria, now every day wahala. Every day, there's too many problems. Let me now go and talk about this man. Oh, why is he not showing? No, 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 no. Now, in face, I want to see. I want to see his own face and his wife. I don't want to see. Yeah. This man behind me is a senator in Nigeria. And I'm going to give you a background of him a little bit. So that for those that are not in it from Nigeria, will get a little bit background. Adamu, the man behind me, no, yeah, the one right here. This is the wife on my left hand side, and on my right hand is Adamu Muhammad Bukachukwa. Adamu Muhammad Bukachukwa is a Nigerian politician. And the current senator representing Bauchi, where Fulani terrorists continue to kill so many people. He has been there since 2019, representing Bauchi, Bauchi North Senatorial District. He was elected as a senator during the 2019 general election under the All Progressive Congress. But he has also been in news for the wrong or should we say something that so many nigerians were like hey are we sure this man knows what he's talking about he was not in the situation room let me play the video then i'll read also the report She has been very tolerant and accepted 
my encroachment, my extended uh, help for my colleagues. Uh, this wish. I don't know why Ahmed Lawan stopped in. Thank you so much, our grandmother Elizabeth Adesoya, and welcome to the live transfer, uh, transmission on the Star Radio UK Network. Mr. Luak Benga, DB, and Shigoni, thank you so much. Kilodeti, Ahmed Lawan, stop it. I hope you hear him very well. Let's play it again, and then I'll read a report about it because already Agbakoba is now urging the president, Bola Tinobu to probe Adamu Muhammad Bukachukwa and also the NDIC. There's just too many fraud in Nigeria. Let's listen again. It was stopped quickly from going further. That is not a good idea when you are talking about your wife doing favor as a as a uh, appeal judge in Nigeria judicial system. But right now, Agbakoba have now asked President Bola Ahmed Tinobu to probe this individual. Do you think it's going to happen? Do you think that Bola Tinobu will probe? Do you think he's going to probe him? Hmm. There's a lot going on in Nigeria. Nigeria is a drama place. A former Nigerian Bar Association president, Dr. Olisa Agbakoba, senior advocate of Nigeria, has urged President Bola Ahmed Tinobu to probe Senator Adamu Mohamed Bukachukwa over his suggestion that he obtained favors from his wife on behalf of his fellow senators. Hmm. Bukachukwa claimed that he encroached his wife's freedom and independence in the course of her official duties as head of the second highest judicial office in Nigeria. According to him, his wife did not rebuke him, but the immediate past Senate President Ahmed Lawan quickly interrupted and disowned the senator from continuing his speech. Senator Bukachukwa Muhammad, representing Bauchi Senatorial District from 2019, he said, according to him, particularly my wife, whose freedom and independence were encroached upon when she was in office, who stopped. She has been tolerant and accepted my encroachment and extended it to my colleagues. Once again, a very good evening and welcome to the live transmission uh, program. Hello. As we uh, we are not taking calls for now, please bear with us. Uh, there is a lot going on in Nigeria. Nigeria is just you know another crime scene. We are now one minute past thirty uh, seven thirty one, and as we know, we should be going straight into uh, the conversation surrounding the Yoruba nation. But I have one more. Uh, video I want to share the audio with us because somebody has been speaking the new chairman of the Nigerian Deposit and Insurance Corporation known as the NDIC Dr. Abdullah Kim Abdullah T makes a big revelation 
exposes the truth, let's hear from him. It's a battle that cannot be left in Zahadi alone. Every head of parastatas in Nigeria must stand up to let him know the rot in your own establishment. I tell you, NTIC stinks. There's a lot of rot going on. They say when you fight corruption, corruption fights you. Now, the document you see in my hand is one of the ways the corruption engineers in Nigeria are fighting back. You know, each time you say, you want to have it to change, like the one brought about by President Ashwai Bola You will have the change champions who will support him, but you have the change skeptics and the game, change, game changers who will frustrate all this effort to rid Nigeria of this mess. Now, this is the purported new act of the NDIC. And I tell you for nothing, this is a nefarious act. I tell you because here they have taken away the powers of Mr. President in respect of the NDIC. Let me start by telling you the mandate of the NDIC. The NDIC is set up as an independent agency of government to ensure that depositors' money is protected in all the banks and all financial institutions to protect it so that Nigerians can be protected from the misbehavior of bank directors, whether in conspiracy with the CBN or when they are acting alone. That is why the NDIC has been set up as an independent body to ensure that the depositors do not cry even when banks fail. So there are four mandates. The first mandate of the NDIC is to guarantee Nigerians who have deposits in all these banks that relax, be calm, your deposit is safe. Number two is to inspect the banks because prevention is better than the banks because prevention is better than cure to go around the various banks and ensure that the, the banks are not let me let me pause it there you, you say why nigeria is backward it's full of so many individuals groups of people Working within and from outside, making the lives of millions of Nigerians not to work. But some believe that that will not happen under the leadership of the current number 16 president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And I can tell that Omotayo Saloko is a big fan of Jagaban and he's trying to convince me. But you can't, it's too late. We are the Yoruba nation. We don't have any hatred or anything against the Nobu, but we don't think that Yoruba people should remain in Nigeria because being part of Nigeria is not who we are. But you went on to say further, Koiki, Jagaban knows everything Baba is bringing. Good Nigeria. Only for four years or for eight years. What happened after that? Are you going to vote for the North in the next eight years after Tinubu has completed the four years and he comes back and if you get another four years, nobody knows yet. You can only guarantee the one that he has now. That has been a question that none of you have been able to answer. Jagaban is going to fix Nigeria. Agreed. What happened after four years? He comes back, he win again, four years. Then what happened after four years? So let us not live in denial. We know that he has not created all the atrocity in Nigeria. He's part of the politics. He's part of the politician. He's part of the game. He's part of the game changer. He's called Jagaban. But the question is, if he changed Nigeria for eight years, power goes to the north. Remember that the president would also come in and change whatever Jagaban have done. Are you going to vote? I'm asking you now, Omotayo Salako, and those of you that are followers of the APC, after Tinubu has fixed Nigeria, you have a job, you are doing well, economy is good, everything is fine. Let's just agree, even though Nigerian debt cannot be repaid back for the next 40 years. But let's agree that Bola Tinubu played his part as a, not from the Yoruba man, but as a true Nigerian. Because we know evidence is out there that Bola Tinobu himself disagreed with Nigeria as a whole from staying together. 
Probably maybe then because he was in exile, he was, his life was under threat, he believed that the Yoruba should have stand on their own. All that changed after he became the president, I mean the governor in 2007 for eight years, is now the Jagaban in Asoro. Can you answer me now? Good evening to you, uh, Prophet John Ogudeli. I'm talking to you now, uh, my brother there, Omotayo Salako. After Tinobu has done all these good things that you are asking him to do, Tinobu is not going to be there after 2031. He goes back to the north. No. Who are you going to vote for? Are you going to vote? Because power is not going to remain in the southwest forever. It has to go to the north or the evils. Who are you going to vote for when it comes to 2031 election? Are you going to vote for the north to keep the power going under either APC? That's if APC is still in existence so that they can continue the work of Tinobu? Or are you going to vote for the Igbos? So let us be a little bit much think about the future. Yes, temporary measure. Tinobu can deal with those temporary measures. Well, how is going to deal with what Dr. Abdulakim, Abdulatif, the new chairman of the deposit insurance? Remember that the Saraki family destroyed some of the banking sector in Kwara State. Depositor lost a lot of money. Ayo Babatunde say, My prayer always is that President Tinobu should try and make a good record. Wari Jinodu say, How come the ex minister of education? Chukwe Meka in Wajuba, a lawyer resigned. Uh, I almost missed out. Let's get that quickly. A lawyer resigned. Um, I'm trying to get that comment back on again quickly on the screen. Uh, this comment, they travel very fast like yo-yo. Uh, how come the ex-minister of education, Chukwe Meka in Wajuba, a lawyer resigned and left us to strike to run 2023 presidential election under the APC ticket, that university loan is a scam. Where is Olakule? Olakule might be very, very busy. Olatunji, I hope so. My brother also went on to say, What if Nigeria is restructured and we start practicing true federalism? Is it a bad idea? Well, that is a question to those outside. I do not believe that Nigeria should be restructured. I don't think we should have a regional government. I believe in a full autonomy, but right question you have put out there, and we hope somebody would answer that. If Nigeria is restructured and we start practicing true federalism, is it a bad idea? It's coming from Olatunja Wopes, my brother here in London. Once again, keep your comment coming, and I'll be reading them out. Let's go back again to more revelation. We've taken 10 minutes out of Ilanomo Dua sponsor program, but I'm sure they will manage because I want to hear more from the exposition of the new NDIC chairman and then straight into that, the question I'll be asking you is, do you think Tinobu will release in the Kanu? Sitting around the depositors' fund to ensure that creditors are, I mean, those who are borrowing money from the banks and those who have the capacity to pay and to ensure that the bank... That has always been the fraud in Nigeria. An average Nigerian doesn't have access to borrow money. To borrow money is wahala. But those that call themselves big man, your elite, they borrow so much money from the bank. And then, remember, uh, my brother, Professor, who was the name of that? Um, is it Nincon? Uh, is it Amcon? Amcon is the one that look after all those that stole money and those that doesn't want to repay. Is it, are they called Amcon? I can't remember. I think something to do with that. Olawale Alabi Selori Ro. At N90Y. I think it's Amcon. Let me check. Um, uh, let's check quickly. Uh, I think it's called Amcon. Amcon is the one that deals with the people that are owing so much debt in Nigeria. I think they are called Amcon. I don't know. I, I don't think that's the right name. Or is it Nikon? I don't know. Uh, Amcon. A M C O N. Okay. A M C O N. Yeah, I know it's something to do with uh, because those are the ones that are running after people that are owing money. A M C O N. So let's see the latest update from them and then we we'll go straight to Inam the Kanu. It's called the Asset Management Corporation of Nigeria. It was actually established under an act of National Assembly in Nigeria in July 2010 
with an intended 10 years lifespan. The concept is in consonance with the operation of the National Asset Management Agency of the Republic of Ireland and Malaysia. Hmm. Annual budget is about 150 billion Naira estimated. But what do we know so far? What have they done? Let's talk about people that are owing money. Amcon, debt, Uber, escapes, arrest warrant, faces arrangement, October 2018. Hmm. Let's talk about it. The Federal High Court in Lagos on Tuesday have now fixed October 18 for the arrangement of Senator Ifani Uba and his firm, Capital Oil and Gas, that borrowed money, alleged indebtedness to Asset Management Corporation. What the NDIC chairman was saying that, you, it's not you that borrow money. Thank you so much, Waris. It is not you. Olawala Labi said, true federalism, Iropo, Iropo. <laughs> I love that one. Iropo. Uh, Baba uh, Prophet Ugudere say, say it loud. Yoruba nation, no going back. Uh, we're going into that conversation in just about a few minutes. Bear with us. Uh, I just want to finish with Amcon. Let's talk about Amcon a little bit. How many people? Nine, six hundred and sixty-nine point four billion dead. What? Jimo Ibrahim loses appeal to recover his assets seized by Amcon again. These are big men borrow money and they can repay back so we have to seize their asset let's go into this one as well and this one is an article that came out on the 9th of june 2023 again in lagos the court of appeal in lagos has dismissed an appeal that was filed by jimon ibrahim the chairman of the global fleet group global fleet group who is challenging the seizure of his 12 assets by the Asset Management Corporation of Nigeria and freezing all his account over his alleged 69.4 billion debt. Wow! Interesting in Nigeria. The happiness and the wellness of depositors. That's our second mandate to go to the banks and ensure that we prevent collapse. Now, the third mandate is whenever the central bank eventually declares that the bank has failed. The NTIC, without interference of anybody, to go there and resolve what is happening. What do you do? I'm going to leave that. I'm sure you all get the message. So it's a big man, big man that borrows money, doesn't want to repay back, and they're also trying to get their asset back. Somebody like Jim Ibrahim, Andy Uba, my uncle, all the way in a very beautiful German. There is Dario Omito can say, We, the Yoruba nation, don't want any sort of restructuring. But a self determination and independent Yoruba nation. Oh, Pari, Shikene, Finito. I love that word. <laughs> yeah. I hope, first of all, we're not going to be happy with you, my brother, Mitogu. I hope, first of all, believe that Tinubu should take us back to that part. So I think we've talked about Andy Uba and uh, I'm also a Nigerian called Blocks Arik Air Asset Transfer. There's a lot of crime around those that does not want to repay back. How Arik became Moribund under Amcon in five years investigation. Hey, yeah. Amcon takes over Glano Nigerian asset over 2.4 billion. Say your money, Nigeria, say your money. Now, I think one new Yoruba nation conversation. Sorry for those of you that will not understand the next 30, 40 minute discussion, but we will summarize all these later. It's all about the Yoruba nation conversation where we discuss everything about the Yoruba people and the reason why the Yorubas are asking for the right to self-determination under the United Nations, under the African Union, and under the right that some say, no, 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 we don't want any more restructure, we don't want true federalism, we want a full-scale. Wale, Ikujimi say, regional government cannot solve the current problem in Nigeria except only a complete disintegration of the country. Thank you so much, Mr. Wale. Ikujun, Ikujunu, Ikujunu. Yoruba Nation is the only solution. Frank Gudu said, no going back Yoruba Nation now, the Afro Nation now. Now, Ibere, Timofe, Bibo, Gome, Yoruba, Nisi, Nipe, Edeka, Fi, we've been talking about Bola Tinubu for the last almost one and a half hour. Now, Yoruba Nation, ni conversation, Bosse, To, Nisi. Kidero, Dori, Inamdekano, Lati, President in Nigeria, 
Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Ki de rousi. Inje rope Tinubu ma finan de kanu si le. A ti pe. To ba pi si le. Ki lo ma shele gangan. Ki de rope ma shele. Che Tinubu ma fi si le. A bi kone fi si le. Bogwa nan ni. Ante le. An wop bi afra. Bwa si ni shepe. An wop nan pe daduro. Gege bi. Inran ti. Ele du mari dadada. Bwa ibere koni pe. Che o ma fi si le. Inye. An wop. To je e. En ton dare an wop bi afra. Che rope Tinubu ma fi si le. Ki le rope ma shele. Ki lo de ti Tinubu. Che ma fi si le. I beri ti yon po lò kon beri ni yen. Lè kon si. Mo ki yon mò de. Mo ki yon ban lagba. Mo ki baba wa shitu yon mò ou mi. Mo ki yon yon jokbon. Ti a yon bè lori yon to ni lò lè. In jè ti nou bu ma fi si lè. O wun li beri. E jè kon kon bò o ni yon. O ni to jade la te nou. Ke wan di outine. Pa o lò se kon. Ki lò sò. Lori bò wò. A ti nam de kanou. Inje, ole to, kama abe fun, igbo wo, pe ki tinu buje ko para wasile, e she wo nigbo wo she, i beri li, mou beri, fen yon jok mou ta jok wa lori e to ni, a sha le yi, e to ti, a si ko yi, o da lori, a won ti won kwe ni, o mou yoruba, a won ti indigenous people, ti won kwe ni kanuri, a won ti indigenous people, ti a mou si a wusa, a won ti indigenous people, ti a mou si pi a pra, K1 the ultimate. Only ki Bola Tinubu. Inye president ti Bola Tinubu. Ko je ki bo wo ko dari wale. Ko fori ji. Pou e she to ba she. E she wo ni bo wo she. O wo ni bere ti mo mbi. E yon mo yoruba. Che i bo wo she ni. A bi o mbere foun kokon. Ki lo mbere foun. Che e to to mbere foun ye. Che e to ye ti wadi ni tama ma bebe foun. Di chori kwe a wara. Scotland, ti wan bere fwen to nan, wwa o fi kou le wan, wwa o fi bon le wan, wwa o di kle wan wante. Ki lo de ti, bwari wwa di kle, i bo wo wante. Ti, ke wan di ultimate wan pa, ti nou bu bebe, lori bo wo. E ga bo di esi, ni nou, o ni ton konyen. Ki lo de ti, bwari wwa di kle, i bo wo wante. O ni kokpe wan, kokpe wan wi. Kokpe yi bo wo, kokpe wi. E she wo ni bo wo she. Ti ti nou bu ma ba wi. E bo wo, e she wo ni nan di kan nou she. Ti wo ma ba wi. E she wo ni inan di kan nou she. Ti, bo la ti nou bu, inye president in enjiri a ma ba wi. She, e toto mbe refou ye. Ti ijoba tinubu onda APC. Tori APC nan ni tinubu. Lò ti tò tinubu kolo lò ji. Inan de kanu bewa. Tori agbo do jè ki bo bwa ba yemon. Be inti wò shè pè lò nan de kanu. Kò yon shè ntò bò fi mourara. Kò si bi e shè fè sò lò sò bò. Bò la tinubu lò gba ikpò bò ari da wò lò wò ni si. A mò bò la tinubu lò ni. A shè ni si, shè kò da inan de kan nou para si ken ya. Kò 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 lò shè jò pwè a fè de wà si nè jiri a a fè ekstradite. 
Nitori pe yi ti wo se yen ni won pe ni kidnapping eyan kidnap eyan ni se tinu bu kan ma dake lori oro inandikanu tori pe inandikanu to nbere pun kokon se iri ti ke won the ultimate to nko yi to ni ko foriji won se ke won the ultimate ti mo pe wo lo jinandikanu be wa ni se ke won the ultimate ti mo pe inti oloye igbo wo nbere fun gege bi omo yoruba e to ni ninu ofin agbaye so ese wo gan lo se de bi pe wo wole wo pe eliminate to ba ri pa se ke won the ultimate a jade a so pe ijoba buhari ro pa se to ba je pe buhari ri igbo wo pa sinu le se ke won the ultimate a jade tori pe ke won the ultimate o jade lati gba ti wo ti gbe oku meji lo se ko mo pon mo yoruba la won meji ti won pa an bere bere pe eyan jogbon eyan ni mo eyin oloye lati gba ti ke won the ultimate ti n gbo pe wo pa eyan sinu le igbowo ije o fi orin babu ari soro abi tori pe buhari gege bi omo fulani bi a ko ni gbo yoruba dada lo se daku lo daduro pe kitinugu de be na ko wa fi orin ba tinugu soro ko fi orin gege bi eni ti won lo ku campaign won ni gbogbo oba ti omo yoruba ba ti jo pelu sk1 the ultimate iyi to ba jo ton leyan du mejo oluka luko wa se ma bere pe ki lo sele gangan ninu ijoba se tinugu to mo pe e ofin agbaye ogba ni bi ti aye de leni pe ke ko lo ji eyan gbe bi e ba ti sagri pelu eyan e bere fun ase ni bi ti e ba ti kamo lati le so pe a fe gbe wa nje won ti gbe abaki ari lo si america e da gbo die sile nkan si idi ti sunday gbo won se wa ni pe na republic ko ju pe ijoba buhari fe pa sinu le bi won se fe pa tinubu na iyin abacha ti tinubu raye salo ona kan ni tinubu gba to fi saku ori nigeria ona to gba yen o le yato so na ti gbo gba amo ohun na sa lo o de si london on exa titi di pe gba ti abata ku ni tinubu para lo sile tori ohun gan ni lole nje won ba tinubu bebe be la bata ese wo gan ni sunday gbo wo se se sunday gbo wo pa yan ni se sunday gbo wo jale ni ki lo wa de ti ke won the ultimate o korin fun tinubu pe oku meji to ko ko pa sinu ile igbowo ni bo ni buhari to je pa mo si ina the can o te fi sinu dss custody inje o le to ko wa ni be bo ba te je pe intina the can o se lowo lowo o ru fi city nigeria iyi ti nigeria wa se nko to lo ji eyan gbe ni 20th century in jewole ji omo ke won the ultimate in jewole ji omo egbe leni lara omo to ni ni lowo lowo ko wa jigbe lati bu to wa ko jigbe lo si lu mi se a wa ma fi orin korin si lu yen pe omo mi ti e jigbe yi o e ba mi da pada ki lo de ti a fe lo la kaye ki lo de to je pe iro la an wa oju aye pere la nse se ke won the ultimate wa oju aye igbowo ni abi bawo abi o nse bi omo yoruba tokun tokun e ba mi fi comment sibe eyan omo yoruba o fe soro lori ti awon biafra o ni awon ti lu yibo eran ti pe go wa ni so pe it was just a little praka lori la mi na ni ke won baba ti yawere wale ikuji mi so pe k1 is one of those that destroy nigeria and yoruba land with his song o to to fi adujo si adujo yan ti lo kaakiri opolopo wa bere pe ko dariji igbowo gbowo bere pe ese wo gan ni gbowo se se igbowo se buhari ni se inti igbowo jade fun lasiko to jade se o wrong nitori pe omo yoruba na ma se pa yin titi di wa kati igere ni o e wa gbo nti ke won the ultimate so lori dg_75 so pe 
But in nice sitting, mighty nice standing, mad people all over the place. In our parents, let them use Google to translate it. Your other Eshegonima. Only cop will know the one in the canoe. Abi, only a hobby afra. In jet in jet on the ultimate mountain, so in your mocking a diet. In your mock when a giriati roughy. Ah, care one the ultimate. In jail one mock way. Nigeria don't call it for you. Oti international law. But the fact that they will go through due process. Lati bena de kanu para si Nigeria. Let's go. This way, Tinubu is part of the people that invaded Igbo Osha house. Ola wale ala biba bawani. Music and religion is to preach for peace. But in Nigeria is lori ro. Eni ojo gbeba wa bere kwe. Se ori tike wani kola wala wai. In Jeoni, T. Omu Lakayewa, he buried in you. But in time, buried in me. Not at all, Dodo. I think he will only assess that in the trouble. In T. Okoko Borosenipe, call Lifty, DSS, Interpol, Top Fisori Bow. In your local Borosh, to repay Ibo Oshe. Kibo will let the side for it. Boba fe wasile, boba ni wasile. Kole lampa ni ati travel. Tori pe mosofu yin pe, e ni wa ni do bene. Ni joti gbo wo ma kuro ni bene. O son le ni kuro, ale ni gbo wo kuro. Ko yin se fake document, do wa lo wo igbo wo. O po lo pon yon mo yi di ti wan se da igbo wo duro. E jen shala e foun yin la le. Bo ya ke wan di ultimate nan mo. I di ti wan se da Iditi, well, uh, Iditi was a da, K1 the ultimate. T, on corner, don't baby. In the woman, Iditi was a da, but Oduro, Nitoripe, and one full lani, was so full job by Bene, a Tibu African country. If you keep it, T, what about the Rebo, Copa on Mole? If you keep it over to Mu. So, Iberi. But our bishop addition on the quick world on music and religion in Nigeria has been used for politics. What is another one of the say Nigeria celebrate Luther, former minister of transport and prominent politician Alaji Umaru Diko, laid to rest in Zaria Kaduna State, Nigeria. Umaru Diko buried because in location nine after looting. So, Yoruba Kinshi Umugo. She APC government owa je party to loya to lo jiyan gbe to ba je yin gbe senu yin ma do ola tun je officer to ba ji yin gbe ko kidnap yin ke lo si abroad ko kidnap yin tori e ma so ni se ni a lot of misinformation on this platform ti bi ba yo ba teyin lorun platform mi wa te lo ma joko si ke lo gbo this platform has been very very accurate and it's not misinformation. Any right, let it walk away for the platform. We are not begging anybody to stay here. More they shall also. They then mumba with directly. Toba jia yigbe. Toba jia yini. Toba jia gbo yini gbo wo. She in timo soni biba. Iru misinformation wo latin so laten gwa. Turi pe le nou yi. Ara yi te ma joko sa broad. Ti e yi gong gong le enfa wo yoni misinformation. Che bi gbo wo ba che ji gbo wo mo be. Tiko wa ni bene republic. Tiko ni freedom e lo to. Bo che kon she a won government titi no bu nan lo shishe ye. Che kon she APC government lo shishe ye. She e min mo shishe ye. Everybody knows the truth. Ki lo de ti e en fe so ti to e yin agbanagba. E yin ti e ba nan jiri a jenon ni ye. Tune taba wi lo taba wi bo ni sin. E yin wa ni bi ti opportunity wa fun yin. She won le kidnap wu any of a won e yon yin ni UK. Can you mask party who can mask sorrow? And they come up to the Kaye, come up to the borough. Statement they put out a lot of misinformation on this platform. A matter of sorrow, a balada, me would expect it be any of the local Jew in the statement. A visit I am. This is not a platform for joking. The Bawa platform for thing joke, and a joke is also share a polybe, and also a gene, and also a waliani, the Bawa and the Biba. And I'm talking to you directly, or Latunja Wofeso. You might not like it, but it's based on your message. 
Now to a lot of misinformation on this platform. Ki ere ni moni sheni bibai. Now to be waka ti meji. Inule yile inwa. E wa very comfortable. Don't ever post such stupid message. And I'm not taking my word back. Te ba comfortable. E on subscribe kuro lo di platform. E lo joku sori. Shou e kori be. Ke wan the ultimate. She ku she ye. O wuna do jeki buwari to ni buwari ti soro. Ati bo. Buwari na lo wa tu soro. Fun yini si. To ni. Bo gwe ni toba. Bo yon fwa jo. Ba yon lo ma she fun. E jag bon ti bo ali so. Oni ki yon kwa koma. Bo yon fwa jo. E yon wa jo ko se ori platform. E nan so misinformation ni diba. Very very biased individual. Any body was okay. A mass of a woman told she was okay. And you are in the UK. I want you to attend party with your friends to hear sorrow. You do more. Millions of Yoruba people. Our family in Baba Nibiba. In many family to one only. Like I say, you are not meant to sit here if you are not comfortable. But am I to ever suffer me pay misinformation? Name of Fisi Nibiba. To read in Timon Sony Nibiba. Timon joke or tapping down on your soul. Or rock or law. Inye la shen koda a on to jen mo tinubu ti soro ni bibay. To jen a on to jen loyali si tinubu. A ti ka comment si won. A ti ba on soro. E yi wan sokwe misinformation li ni pi si bibay. Che ti igbo woni misinformation. Che ti igbo wari ni misinformation. Che ti nandikano. Che inandikano ti bwari lo jigbe yen. Che o fin abaye a septe be. E te kan wa very honest. Lo ti to mo yoruba ni tinubu. A de sokwe abaja. But the fact is. E yi ti ke won wano un bebe. Fubuari, Fubu, Tinobu, Coco, Pepe, eh? And woe, who told what low one more? In Jay, you mock, what could make it? Say what they blow, Puny? In a bomb officer, Tabasu, a lawyer to, over there, Petty Daddy. Say what they blow, Puny, for the Meji. Come on, see your Puny, K. and Made, Tara, Kawasa, quit misinformation. Most of me, and you can tell one, UK. Sometimes, be aware that me, to repay a man's only by me, whether you keep it get as it be. And like I say, I am not apologetic for whatever I have said. Koji Dodon, the Bafi Joku Sibi, and I've always respect you. As much as I know, and you're more tinubule, you know, and you're not so me. I know that based on Interman call, I then accommodate everybody. But like I said, the Bafi, money can also do in KTNT, the law will in KTNT. Mad people all over the place, according to Yawa Elizabeth. Oku 26 million, Lori to Star Radio, not like she was. Maybe I think Fioro, Joe Mioro. On she pa hate was you. I don't hate him, but in tons very fun. Right it here, no ni. On oton fin very ni. Na ti ba ti no bu soro kwe. Ko fi bo o si le. Ko she bo o ni kono koni fun. E jang bon to kwa. Koda, o koni fun o bi apra no. E jang bon to so. And then can comment to what Lori Mix aloud. Some people abroad are useless. They overthink of themselves. Eh, Paolo. Allow Baba Nikke one must be stupid. He's saying this because they are all afraid of Sunday. Go now. Oh, Matayo. So we we know what Buari said, but that is why Tinubu said I will still not. On your door, brother. Thank you so much, uh, Salako, my own brother as well. Oh, my Yoruba niwa, but she might go to Kale. Oh, my Yato Sera wado to. What more? Me fake you on what's up me pay misinformation and PCB by. Ah, we me on my lawyer me pay ki. Emma so them. I am not talking about the bow. I am talking about people right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Platform. Everybody has the right to write anything. Every everybody not agree, but then you need nobody agrees with you. So to why I pay me call ambassador. That's fine. But in the back of a decade of no quartier, TV UK Ladoa was up with freedom of speech. Ah, sending you military dictator. And hey, if people write anything that is against you or something that is contradicting to you, we take a fish in there. We accommodate Arawa. We accommodate everybody. I want to go and accommodate you. Or do you want to go and do more research and media? Or do you want to go and do more to the end? No, I'm a bit of me. But we could to accommodate. And to put me problem ten years, to buy the other day to us all. But one thing is, yellow shape many social media. And it's all about taking heat. 
e ni joko si ni social media yo koda omo to nse ida ba ida ba sa bi kero to se dano ton he he bo wo video omo e lana o nla gun lori chia be la so to wo to be da bi a lo so he o ye yi ki ma pe gbe nu soro itori pe o ti lo ko seke seke si ona ma gba 25000 lati wa ki greet and greet so e je ka get message here there is a social media is a new norm you will read some comment you will be upset but we have to all accept more they stop anybody from writing whatever they want to write but if they are going to take on the ultimate is all done oh that's it in the canon not that you are the k1 oh you know the canon you know that you are the obey dss lower egg below see kenya father take him back to kenya kewa chef prepare a proper extradictory or extradition of inam the canon back to nigeria she be ever ki a you know nigeria this is america now okay what is shaking me? What is Musile? Let us as much in your lessons of way a meal or lie on the coiki, a meal bound way pisida, move a pity pita. But Yoruba nation, no going back. Yoruba nation for lie. And I got the last 25 seconds of K1 the ultimate. Uno no goes away. What is this all? Rotting bro. We go along with your name. Eh, Bokiba Muffy. No, I keep away. You look at what. E mo ki da da ibo mi a ofe so e ye lo fi so pe e mo ni yin e na e gba ta o yan ba nko lori comment e mo ju kuro nbe e ye ko ti ka yin na mo ju kuro nbe a wa na gbogbo e na gbogbo e kola na a wa na ma mo ju kuro nbe ni you cannot call yourself koiki call yourself mr reality thank you so much mr olawale alabi eh e se gan ni i am not angry i'm just shocked about what people are eh they ba shock ile aye ta wa ni sin ani se ko si kokon to gboro shock yin mo e north america e sa ri gbogbo ton lo ta le ma fi gbe nu so iba ile ni na wa eh e sa ri okunrin ato birin eh eh ta ma fi gbe nu soro so ki la pe so si yen ki la pe so si yen e wo awon to to lo si white house white house na won ni je ko wa mo iwo wo mo lu abi lo mo e gbo lo si gbogbo nkan sile eh o ki lo se leke e ja gbo ki won de otimi Only two months, you put in a bullet shiny and he buried Timon Berry, cut to the pay about the Siwaju, a second, Mr. K1, the ultimate. At Iguala, it is she. We hope Tinobu will do as you have requested. A cook with Tina, not in the cake, but we can enjoy our sort of other. Okay, I'll cry on it. Was you should just keep quiet and leave you. I'm only running now. In Bolafiati was you see by the radical keep quiet. Moki Buba, our media as well, not to share. Back to back, eh, Omoluka not in there. Ya laje na wa live. Ah ah, bugwe nlo leto leto ni o. Amandu kwe fun, anu nyawa. Ono ene du mari, akuku wa kolua. Moki baba wa, anu le ten ten. Moki bobo mo yoruba, aki bobo yoruba. Eh, a musician flow with the flow. Be ni, ah, eh, ento no na ni, omo kwe yubo wuna ni voice ni. So, wuna an she, yunga bato le she ni. Ito li kwe, omo kwe, Sunday ade ye mo. Ti bobo a mon si, enke e Sunday go wo. Eh, o te ni bipi o konti e je ka play eh eh audio ni e je ka play eh eyan ti baba wa oloye dokito sunday adeyemo oni my name is sunday gbowo eh in to fin tori eja gongon mo fe ka gbo together eh e fun mi ni few minutes once again a very good evening as we are now on to the last 20 minutes mo kin da da gbo mi eh pe gbo mi leje and I love you so much. I know very respect your views. Emma, what in the mouth? Do in the comment section? There's nothing you can do to that. You know, let's tolerate each other and manage the situation. Mufei lo play Babawa Oloye Doctor Sunday Adeyemo Ibo. Idito fin sope. Enyomo Yoruba asikoto eja fin Nigeria sile. Let's see if it's this one. Okay, it's not this one. Uh, bear with us. I have a mother day. Moki, the boy, a young man, you robot, nearly local. Thank you so much to each and every, every, every one of you. A young woman, a Jacob Mashi, in Tanshi. Without you, Baba Joko Siba, a lot of all. Kill a mama, she, eh? Um, okay, again, Lawa. One minute, everyone. Let's try and get the engineers trying to get. Uh, Igbo video that he did with the BBC. I just want us to enjoy that uh, just for a few minutes. The reason why 
he says, Tabati se tabe se ki aki aloma mi buari ma no na tinubulu wa beni si. Bear with us. Andrew no check out to Nigeria go survive. Are you sure? Say what? All right, let's see. Let me quickly try and see if I can bring. I have the video, so I don't know why we are not getting it quickly. Uh, but let's see if I can uh, bring it uh, quickly. Uh, bear with us. Ah, no, 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 no. All right, I'm going to leave that for now uh, because I was going to play a particular video of uh, Dr. Yeah, I think that's it. I got it. I think I enjoy video. So I'm going to play this video just for you to get the message of why Igbo Abdullah Okwewole. Thank you so much. Let's watch this in just about a few minutes. Oroko Mini Sunday, Adeyemo. Tibo Gwenye Mosi Sunday, Igbo Ho. Samo Gwenye Mba Jomo Bada. Togo Angbeko, Amo Kweni Ava Bada. Oni Mba Kweni Ava Kweni Ibada. properly bear with us let's arrange it a little bit proper uh let's arrange it proper uh there's another sound we are almost there uh it's been almost a long one but as usual it's a wednesday uh how many people listen to the 18 year old boy don't plead to me anybody continue with your reality thank you so much uh every single one of you let's listen to uh, I think we need to let's listen to Dr. Sunday Boo. Okay, I'll so let them come in that shot because I was not sure if my mic was mute, everything, but it seems everybody is hearing me anyway. Let's hear it. Boo, ni <laughs> Bobo Wawala, Ladoja, a Tampa Badi di Bumbadana, who bought two alliance, so you want one for him pitchy Ladoja, one for your Ladoja, and poor one for your Ladoja, and 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 your Ladoja, so baba kon fe ka ba fulani ja ka o baba wa gugu awon ba wa gugu awon baba baba wa o saju kon po wa si meeting kon de fun ara pe to amo yi o ki royin de si gbe ki gbugbu aye ori pe to awon ni won so pe to ka koju won gbugbu bi ti ya ba ti fe je o ba ka fe si be olohun mo mo mu wa agbara mi lo wa la won fulani wa ni won o to ton pe ra won o folo bura fun yi won o to ton pe ra won olohun ba lodun ma re so, but I have any in the tea, I want any load down, but I do not have a cabbage in loans in Cabota, also a look on me. Found Baba, Baba, Queen, and Jay, and all you back, Conquer Bubu as a meeting. Conquer on it, Conquer Laugh, and Conquer Baba, our daily book on by it. Toba Duku, Conquer, Conquer, and Vice Bubu. A lot of a lot of a new tongue account. I want to talk about a do up for love for top of the bell or Conquer Bubu or door. So, this is a mark on door. Toba Macaulay, Caruana, Bana, is in the Padalic. Cockua, Cower the Duco, Cow Bassavessi, Till the sink. Every bunk come up, and we ran Bumbo, Woody Mini, and we are all the commandimo, all the Antimus Solo, you worry, and we are Lully Serai, and the Mutu Massacre, you do it, you're so mewa. Sink at him, so you may ask me and Nuni. So I want you a most of one Nuni, a me more belonging to the Mia Dombo. Only the good is sorrow, you know. So, what we can get along with this, me, when it is on the boo, more about our Abba, but I will not allow you, but the Latin Abuja. So, just your come up and get it. You do go over the Yalos alone, or you are one day, Tabat Dara Unisi, Eddie Bay, or you are low. 
Do you want to see us at the museum? Talk about the new music. We are going to do it. Do you want to do it? 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 Kolo awa baba yen, tan baba yen o siwi, kan sa yin fun wakpe Awa la siwi fun yin pe, iya wodo jye yoba Bobo biki viti ilè yoba de Elo sabo lori e pa amante ba mambe ke zabo Amambe, amambe le le Baba yami, amambe yoba mbe le Ti wun ni sarara Amante yon wotan do, amante yon wotan do ko wanyi Wun yiswa mwa yisa nari lo But, ok bobo Ah, le gansokwe ya, e mwa lò si kiri bi tanti mwa tanti mwa kenapu yoba E mwa lò sobo, e mwa lò lò ni, e mwa lò kama lò si Yo din kami mwa lò Tò mwa ti dan lò jupe, a wwa la an biwa A wwa si la an baba, a wwa ni baba wwa lè yoba mbi Wè si se baba buruku, wè dè sò da lè baba Ti fi yay domon, ka wwa mè an bòk bada lè kon o ti wà si wà di baba lò baba ni lò Ka wwa bòk bada lè kon di ka kani sò ni bè Baba lò baba ni lò, ba wwa gaga wè se bè Tò lò nta an baba, an baba kan an bè tò ng Awo ni zogu vano, botan o tan o ba wa jeba ba da a da Ti mwa de fè fi a ton botan yari ule fa an mwa wwa Kwa yi kwa bwa bwa de fun yo ba Kwa yi kwa 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 bota ane kwa wade duti wa kwa yeni so ni be Oloye, Dr. Sunday, aka Sunday Gowo With the BBC, some few years back bosa 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 for oloye sunday Gowo, the family the prophecy igbowosha it later came to reality there are more nigerians that are still being killed we pray that the president bola Tinobo will be able to curtail not just the yoruba land the insecurity across nigeria the report coming out every day is not very good I'm going to give us uh, just some quick update on the news in the next five minutes because this program ends at exactly 8.30 on the Star Radio UK network. If you haven't followed us on the Star Radio UK, please do so. Muki Bugwe Yololu Fewa once again. For those of you that have been there, Adams Olamile Khan, shout out to those of you in Benin Republic. A shout out to the, the Professor Oracle Adebanji Akitoye. We believe that there will be some kind of committee that Tinobu will set up. I don't know when. This movement is a non violent. It has never been. We have always been a peaceful agitation asking for the right. A letter has been communicated to Tinobu. We've talked about it. The Oracle Adebanji emeritus gave a very powerful speech in the statement which i'm just gonna under a few minutes on this historical occasion of the inauguration of our beloved brother ashiwa jubola ahmed tinobu as the president of the federal republic of nigeria and the commander chief of armed forces of nigeria i professor adebanji akitoyi the chairman of the Yoruba Self-Determination Movement, for and on behalf of the overwhelming majority of the Yoruba people, home and in diaspora worldwide, who seek self-determination and the sovereignty for the Yoruba nation, deeply and sincerely rejoice with our brother on the fulfillment of his political ambition to preside over the affairs of the Nigerian state. After exactly eight years ago, Ashiwaji Bola Tinobu's energetic and sincere and dedicated assistance to another Nigerian citizen enabled that citizen to rise to this same position of president and commander in chief of Nigeria, which is pres the former president Muhammad Gwari is referring to. Therefore, nobody, none of us citizens of Nigeria, cannot say that he does not deserve the same elevation for himself today. Indeed, his elevation to the presidency of Nigeria against all the odds. Emefele wanted to change the money. They wanted to make sure that there's no petrol. But yet, Bola Tinubu say, 
ama dibo ama wole e ba gbe po pamọ e ba toju owo emi fele now is in the custody of the dss even bola tinugu himself will only be there for few more years we pray for good health this is why some of us are saying do the needful because you have what it takes to do so at this particular time indeed is elevation to the presidency this program end at exactly eight minutes on the star radio uk network and we appreciate my producer mr frank david and mr archie babakito went further therefore none of all citizens of nigeria cannot say that he does not deserve the same elevation for himself today indeed his elevation to the presidency of nigeria against all the odds that we Nigerians are painfully familiar with and against all the man-made contortion of the order that characterize Nigeria, demonstrate clearly the tenacity of the spirit that characterize his political career. He wants to become the president and I don't think he can ask for anything more. Maybe a king? I don't know. But for now, his ambition is to be the president. He has become the president, Beato Bashiton. I don't know whether he will become like a king, but for now, he can only be a president for maximum eight years according to the law and the constitution of Nigeria. This man-made contortion of the order demonstrate the fundamental bankruptcy, the essential non-sustainability of the Nigerian state, which our brother must now leave. It is particularly noteworthy that all the electoral cycle under the successfully fraudulent constitution of Nigeria since 1959 ended up unutterably in controversy that are irres irresistibly and that are ultimately never resolved. And this is where my brother Wokeso and the rest are saying we should go back one step back to where Nigeria was for true federalism. How they will have to manage that with the 1999 constitution. I will be running a program later on on my sister broadcast talking about the Mali constitution is going to be changing. How come Nigeria constitution refused to change since 1999? Will Bola Tinobu have the capacity, the balls to change that? Time will tell as we monitor his own government. He has done just three weeks. There's still a lot. DZ 123 said we are entering into a revolutionary era of innovation whereby we are using just advanced intellectual property right to build the urban nation. Natural resources can stay in the ground for the future usage. This week is London Tech Week. And if you are looking up to the kind of innovation that I've been looking up at uh, Queen Elizabeth II Center, it's just unbelievable. But one thing is, the Yoruba that are still in the hope that we can go back to true federalism, is that with the 1999 constitution? Do you know that Mali is changing their constitution? All these I'll be educating you on the sister broadcast. But for now, just to move swiftly, the Nigerians stand at this moment in a devastating pain of the unresolved nationality problem. So, Omotayo Salako, our problem is not Tinubu. Our problem is not Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Our problem is the nationality. Nationality, Tani Nigerian, Tani Yoruba, Tani Awusa, Tani Fulani, Tani Igbo, Tani Pedu, uh, Edo, Tani Kanuri. Nationality problem. As highly prospective leader of another African country remarked recently, the nations of Nigeria ate one another and the hatred is steadily escalated since independent and yet our political leaders like Bola Tinobu, our governors, our house of reps strangely choose to keep Nigeria as one country. It is an update from the 1966 constitution. Is that the 1999 constitution you're talking about, uh, my brother Ufeso? So, uh, like I said, I, I've been following Mali constitution. They are bringing down their old constitution from 1992. They are planning to use a new constitution, but their citizens have to vote. Should this have happened in Nigeria? Because everybody agrees. All the senior advocates of Nigeria, 
all the political groups, everybody agrees that the 1999 constitution is a military dictator. Even Robert Clark, the senior advocate of Nigeria, said so clearly. Once again, this is how far we can go on the Star Radio UK network. I'll be back again same time next week, Wednesday, where we will be coming up again with a different conversation. And I'll be coming with one of our brother that is into farming that will be telling us what they are doing, how we can encourage more people. Uh, let me see if I can. Let me see if I can get that music. Uh, let's listen to this. How many people remember? Let's listen to this. Ah, no, 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 no. No. It's this it's coming straight to my ears. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Let it go, Mr. Oguye Wagyu, Mokima, Mokisa, rather. This is Samo Yoruba, don't marry for Yoruba nation. Wake it up, Nisha. Nisha, he lay. Hey, hey, Bobby Joe. I'm a jale. I'm for a sofa. Moki, I told you, I'm a wake it up. He wake it up. I see your go. Go, you see your dad. Go, you pay. Thank you so much once again. This is the Star Radio UK Network. Michelle, 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 Hey, that is the way Kiko, which literally means that if you do not study, at least go back to farm. Sunke, thank you so much. Uh, it's been a beautiful Wednesday evening. Uh, 1999 Constitution is a fraud. Addition or when others say the same thing happened to the NDIC. We already played a video about that. We hope that Tinobu will do the needful. That's all we are asking for as Yoruba people. Whether those that believe that a true federalism will stabilize Nigeria, the Igbos will do their own regional government in the eastern region, uh, the Aousa will do theirs in the northern region, the Middle Belt region, the southwest region, this I don't know whether the south south, whatever. So man, make it things easy is what we want. And on that note, this is how far we can go on the Star Radio UK Network. Join me again next week, every Wednesday from 6 p.m. as I review and discuss everything about the Yoruba nation. Thank you so much once again to my producer. I'm checking out now. But before we do that, remember, it is called Star Radio UK. Okay. This is so real. Thank you so much. Have a very good evening. Bye for now. Broadcasting worldwide online 24-7. Broadcasting worldwide online 24-7. In your car. On your smartphone. The best radio show. The best radio show. The best radio show. Broadcasting worldwide online 24 7. All right, hey, Temi, Temi. Now that we've left the Star Radio UK, we can switch back to uh, our own platform here called the Koiki Media. Uh, let's move things around. Let's leave this one here. Uh, let's first move things around. Uh, Let's go and give you our intro. Then that's all there, Abi. Um, that's all there. Call oh, the media. We bring the world to your doorstep. Call the media. We bring the world to Ni 
baba Oi que miga 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 They never know what thing we carry for body. But if they move closer before they go sabi. Okin lo lo ja e e, ni un lo lo la ju. Aye to do ni ko do bi a do, ko je le do. Kasi chefu le baba wa, kasi chefu ilu baba wa, kaju mo so wa po kale ko do do a ka, ko do do a ko ba le ke wa. Omo o do do a se giri. Edi de fun e to a do la wo. Kale jo ju mante. Kale ileri. Kawale pa oko ilewa. Kasi se kale jo ba de. Kale ba de a de a do la wo. Awa ni mante ti yo tan kakiri. Awa langwe to la ruge E to to po jogo Ti wa mani Kasa E to po lo wa ja wa ka je buba Awa kini le akonsi E yi ti koiki E kako soro briefly Katu ma pari eto ye It's been a very very long night You know Wednesday get as it be Muki e kwa mi awo fe so Ola ba wa po lo yi Ani shera wa ima wori Muki wubwe yi ojokbon Yela se ma kubi ba ini Ile ojokbon DZ 1, 2, 3 The president, be ni African Development Bank Pino man take 300 years We should get ready for Igbo Wosha And Baba Professor Banji Entry back Agbaro long Ama awo le Ino bu gamma Si kato le shi si Walai Ko sing on tenny boy le she si. Wako li, wale straight down ni. Everybody mok li. Che, a mama, che, e mi mama gwe ni ta forever ni. E mi nan pon li. E kou bie, e la wako she gubo, inte e ka she di le ton. Ko se ni kokonto mama le yon di, pa malen ti da, ni bubu wa. Ento ba nan ni wale la ni ba. But everything takes a process. A ti koko jakara. Se baba. Si baba wele, on lori buru ku sambodi. Mo ke ugo yinye yonwa. Si la pia, eh? Ataro, ori program la washa, la taro. So, wo gwa la makpada si le, wo gbo wa ku seni to ma wale yon di. Because, Nigeria ko le survive for a very long time. Aboro me yini se. Survivor of Nigeria, diye lo ku ba. So, kwen yon kon ni pada si le la ni bu gwa yon yon ni, ezan kwa wun kwa zi kwa wun le. So, mo ta fwe pepa, baba ki to yere pe mo ting ka o di fe, bi shen ka ba e lo, ba shen pe, shen bi shen ka son ye yin sha, e yin yon ti yon te yon bo wa a te do li, shen bi shen sha e analisi si, statement baba ki to yon, shen o wa ok, ba shen bi ye wo di bu bu ba, so wa ok sha, at least, you know, Mi yon di nan ni. On la de de, agbe i mi yon di wada de. Mi chi gwo gwo yi, agba la gba wo, mi sta di, ok yon dan kon, obri ni wong, ade ke mi, yon yon mo, obri ni wong di ade ke mi, underscore lori, underscore ade, mo ki yon. We have a lot of people that watch us on Instagram as well. Thank you so much. Yes, ok, this is ok, yes, alright. So, I don't know if I program here good. I think it's two hours starting something. I don't know if it's a program. I came in a lot of relax. I'm family. So thank you so much. We will start back again as usual with our lecture. And to our lecture, I'm going to show you the police. I'm going to show you. It's just under one hour, 20 minutes. Oh, very, very important. Police is very, very important. So I think I'll try to go. Then I think I'll start to share link a video a uh, youtube channel me here because a lot of people have a lot of subscribes you know the ember wa jani eh i just can show page in front of katumalo emma bako ikijana eh 
Voilà, ti Yoruba ni chanan ni yoma oulo fun. Mouni di yinke la subscribe si be. Eje ki show page yin len konsi kwen kato man lo. Kin de share link yin ka kiri. Eje ki koko share no. So yinti ma chene kwe ma koko share video kon ni nwen. So ma wa eje yin share video kon ni nwen. Ma wa show link yin fun yin again. Ko yi ki media tv lo nje eba alo si be. Nous ma kibou bo ingrama, te dro to the program kwa lwa kwa izi. Be shen lo to ribi wa elen lo si ton. Olan ni kon lo le son yin le son. It's not easy at all. Ok? Ele yo jek in post, ono ko 3 days. So e wolo anje ka post, kon an kwele ni mo rai post ilen kon. E den post wa so le le. Nous ma wa lo do yala jeni jo Saturday, kon lo an kou shawa di ba yin. E support e platform wa. Mais là, il y a des gens qui ont été en train de se faire. C'est important. Et moi, je suis en train de faire une big, big plateforme. Je suis en train de pomper sur moi. Donc, si vous voulez nous compétir aussi, vous allez bien. Si, à plus, quand vous n'avez pas de pays, vous n'avez pas de pays assez. Parce que j'ai dit 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 que j'ai dit. So, e jen share link yen kwa luyi. E ba mi gba wole, mi gba wole, mi gba wole yeto la le. E gba wole ke le subscribe. Ki nomba yen te, ko change la le, ki da wali sin lo. E jen wobi ta wali sin. So, let me show you now, le jen ki wa share lo screen. Kato ma lo la le. E lo ba wa subscribe, en to ba yeti subscribe. E lo subscribe to where. E ba ki mo ten so kwe ke le subscribe bo. For that particular channel, Because new channel ni, so it it's gonna take some time for to build up. If not, you tell the brother, hey, bah, my son, you know, come on, look, hey, bah, my subscribe. But this one is different. So channel ni, let them wait. Eshigo ni, eba wa gbawoli, e gbawoli link ni. So channel ti mo so ni le. So it's a new YouTube channel. Yo, I've not posted any video. In the next, in the last, only one, only one around 33 subscriber. It's not very good at all. How are you? Mm -hmm. you okay? Finished. Yeah, finish here. But just one minute. You, know, you can't come to the camera yet. You okay? Good job. So, you know, go single auto and be a subscribe. Better you tear any notification. Everybody perfect low on videos that they post today. At least I have about over close to 100 videos. Aye, go there. Two hundred law. I have one hundred and sixty videos. She go go let it law. Go go video to one man. Go possible now. Aye, Abi Odun Lexi. Go go in Barabata. Aye, tell her low Instagram. Mo mo lose my post. So Instagram. Mo mo wo Instagram. Me da da. Ah? Mo la Nigeria. Oh, mo bo shin lo mo social media. Wo a lo di TikTok. Wo a lo di this. Mo bata wa ba le manage now. So these are all the videos I've done. You know, you you will enjoy it honestly. I want you to go there. Wow, I'm about to do one too. Video, short short videos. Ne, it's bad man. She want to have a bad. I'm full of relation. But lie. Could the side back maybe so you can just watch it. I'm bad full of relation. You. This is part of what. Remember to make sure you come. Right here in Akinbi in Abel. Akinbi, in Abel, Kuta. Is the ninth of uh, March 2019, and as you can see, I'm full of the by you. You don't believe city life. I've been here, Mura. You're going to come on, Jerry. Eh, but I will go young, that is so many days. Bye bye, bye bye, bye bye. I'm going to go they don't, this is where they leave. And what they now do is, I'm coming, I'm coming, just a few minutes. Come and read your book. All right, so Gucci, no, don't come here. I'm coming. No, you can't sit on me. I'm coming. Just two minutes, okay? So, hello, subscribe. I'm going to do a thing for me then, my love. I'm going to lock away from you. I'm going to go to the concert. So, that's how far we can go tonight. Thank you so much, NetTech Electrical. 
your banishment is for life, your banishment is going back. I'm a play and tell me, and then I close the podcast, and that will be about it. So, to do that, I've done a lot of video today. Go and watch it. And there's no advert on all those videos, so it's just a straight watch. Moke Kule Bakers, Moke Mr. Clement, and the rest of you, Mrs. Bimi Leke, and all our mothers, you know, whether I mention your name or not, we love every single one of you. So, I can play Antenna, come on. Talk about it to me. Well, Antenna, you want. Yeah, that's it. Antenna, my love, Daddy Gong. I reduce volume TV. Who that wrong? Odaro, bye for now. Koiki Media bringing the world closer to our doorstep. Mokenta, I'll remix a Thanks so much. Bye for now.